All right, man. I'm going to try to do a reaction in the dark. See if I like I kind of like it right now, actually. It's kind of cool. I uh, feel like feel really zoned in. But um, I bought an acoustic guitar two weeks ago, and I see Chester P with an acoustic. This was dropped six months ago. Never do things by halves. And so I want to check it out. Um, I'm not very good. I mean, I, I know how to do a few chords and stuff, but I'm always, I mean, uh, just a phenomenal poet. Um, and there's a poet that Chester P actually commented and recommended to me. I would have to look back on the comment. Um, I didn't look into the guy, but he said this guy is a brilliant poet. And if Chester's saying it, then it's got to be true. Um, but let's just check it out. See what he's got. Never do things by halves. Where is it? 21st of February, 2024. Half the time I wake up and have to ask myself Am I half alive or dying in a hardened shell? With half a match that I can light up for the darkest spells Half the time I'm halfway up a path to jail I'm feeling just as drunk as my father felt As he emptied out his jar into half a spell Half a mile away I'm standing in the yards of hell Trying to sell a house that I constructed from the cards I was dealt See me laughing half as loud as all the last and well Half my life man I stood where the heart this dwell. The sky shattered so I grabbed the sharpest shard that fell and dug up half the graves where I knew that all the martyrs dwelled like doodle bugs dropping. Wow man so much packed in there already. Um, I mean you know he's, he's mentioning because I know he's he's had maybe some addiction problems when you guys had said something on the channel um, and I you know I'm no stranger to that myself. Um, but uh, you know he's, he's saying his father seemed to be a drinker and um God, it's so hard to absorb Chester P on a first listen. Like it's is he packs so much in it's one line. You could really you have to stop, pause, and think about it. Um, but I end up having to do multiple listens to Chester P and then it starts to sink in. Um, but the theme is obviously half of things. Um and the, you know, obviously the title, you know, you can surmise a little bit from that. So let's keep going. In over Clark and well, I do the drugs just to sit and try and charge myself and laugh at death and send you all a card from hell. I'm half compelled to half all of these halves to sell. I'm half a man. My legacy is half a son. I'm so depressed. I'm handling my halves and ones. I'm half asleep. I'm fiddling with half a gun. To blast myself would only give me half the fun. They told me not to do things by halves. So I half laugh, coughing half a bong up from a half a lung. Yeah, they told me not to do things by half. So I half laugh, coughing half a bong up from my half a lung. And it seems to me it needs to be addressed. So I need to try to believe that I can free this from my chest. See, my dreams are now the reason where I know. Oh my God, dude. Just that this. It seems to me that. Hang on. I don't care. I'm rewinding, man. As a poet, I, I'm so fascinated. So I need to try to believe that I can free this from my chest. See, my dreams are not... I'm not... I wouldn't call myself a poet, by the way, but as somebody who likes rhymes. Now the reason where I never seem to rest, I am... So I need to try to believe that I can free this from my chest. See, my dreams are now the reason where I never seem to rest. I am pitiful up from my half a lung and it seems to me it needs to be addressed so i need to try to believe that i can free this from my chest so it seems to me that he so he he does seems to me does a rhyme with that needs to be addressed and then rhymes the entire line the next line with the first line with the e to e e to e needs to be ad addressed um you know s god dude god like, this is so inspiring. You guys got to understand, if you've ever tried writing uh, lyrics, um, I mean, I'm able to rhyme full lines at this point, um, but making it so cohesive, and I, I mean, making it so cohesive uh, so that there's a message, and then also kind of a, a life lesson or deeper meaning is so difficult um, to just do that from nothing. And, and the, you know, the template is your own thoughts, and then you go off of that first line or sometimes I'll come up with a line and then I'll work my way back from that. But this is just so, so well done. I mean, the writing is, is top level, top notch. Um, 
really good. I'm gonna rewind it again, and I don't care. I, I'll lose. I don't. I really don't give a shit. They told me not to do things by half, so a half laugh, coughing half a bong up from my half a lung, and it seems to me it needs to be addressed. So I need to try believe that I can free this from my chest. See, my dreams are now the reason where I never seem to rest. I am pitifully blessed, but typically depressed, and it seems to me it really needs to be addressed. I am seasoned with the best of them, as critically depressed. So if you figure it's too quick of me to trigger off and stress, I am quickly assessed as typically depressed now, now that's fascinating to me he says critically depressed and typically depressed but at no point does i don't think he mentioned clinically depressed which w would have been you know the perfect rhyme but i think there's a reason he says critically and typically depressed but not clinically i wonder if it's because oh god there's just there's so much you could you could read into with so many of these um, that he does. I want to listen to this fire in the streets again, man. I want to listen to that right now. That's the thing. Chester P is just so damn good. So damn good. I'm going to end this reaction, man.